seconds to battle. Bum, we are pretty strong on level 1. Let's try to get both wounds. Oh yeah, we have pretty strong level uh, 1. Luna. Nova. Luna. Nova. The battle begins. Watch over me, goddess. It'll be a good show. I'm gonna follow him. Bum, 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 bum. You can't cancel this TP, there's no point. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Keeps chasing him. Yeah, yeah. This game, hard position one. Clockwork off lane, he wants to gank people, he doesn't even pressure lanes. Lina wants to gank people. This is this safe lane is a very very hard position one hard carry. A lot of the times in this patch, the safe laner is not really the position one hard carry, but in this game I have to be. Just looking at the other heroes, Willow silencer supports and yeah. I think we're laning against Windrunner only, which means we're gonna have a D. Okay, it's duo lane. Oh, well, I'll try not to die. They do have a strong lane. Those two two heroes are pretty strong. Hello. Achieved first, first blood. blood. Thanks and for have fun. And for the dark moon. And clockwork is safe, chaos on. I'm gonna get myself more region. Actually, I'm gonna get mangoes as well. The Windrunner has a salve. With the next beam, we're gonna force the salve and then... Oh, he already used the salve. Use creep aggro a lot as much as possible. If I right click close to them and specifically close to the Windrunner, she will just hit me. I need a duo lane. Oh, I thought he left. He leaves for one second and they almost killed me. How much the duo lanes depend on each other right now? Killing spree. Hello. Yo, doctor. Can you fix your Thanks connection? Two. Double kill. You are losing us a lane now. I don't know. 
So what do you play then? Do you have fun? <laughs> okay. We ended up killing both of them, that's alright. Tusk is not here, we may take this as well. Blessings upon a loyal warrior. Okay, we get two. This is a really good moment to pull right now. It's pushing super hard right now. What happened? They stopped attacking. Runes. What runes? Normal runes? Tusk is roaming. I have to be a bit careful with this Windrunner. He's not close to 6, he's still 4. But when he gets 6, top he could top just top run at me. Not on my watch. Your bottom tower is under attack. Dire structures are fortified. Your bottom tower is under attack. It's not time yet. Lunar light. Your bottom tower is under attack. I could use a couple of clarities right now. But the courier is in use, that's okay. He has a remnant. I'm gonna need to skill ultimate here. I want to quickly regen my mana and go back to lane. He's not strong enough to prevent me from laning. I just need mana, so when he goes on me and overextends a little bit, I can ult him and kill him. Your top tower is under attack. He's level 6 now, so if he ults me, he might kill me. But Your I have my ultimate as well. Attack. The way I'm gonna play this, I think, is I'm gonna push. Just gonna right click. The Ring of Aquila on, and just gonna right click the creeps. Missing me. Still I don't want the lane static, he has more range than me and he will hit me. Beam. Unworthy. Lunar light. 
And I need to stay full on mana. Bottom three bottom. The thing now is that I can't, like, when I don't have ultimate, I don't have the kill thread, so he might be able to kill me. And since I'm a hard carry position one, space taker, I'm gonna try to accelerate my farm as much as possible. I only care farm this game. He's going for Hell of Discord. Uh, Ember. Look at this Tusk. He sees clock disconnects and he immediately goes towards him trying to kill him. <laughs> Jesus. Manta should be pretty good this game. Manta gets me out of Searing Chains, Frostbite, Troll Axes that make me miss. Manta also pushes out lanes. This is like super super good Manta game. I can use... Extremely good Manta game. Since we have heroes that are like gankers, killers... And we don't have that much lane pressure and tower pressure. My illusions can very easily push lanes constantly. They're going top. Careful top. Also, they have decent gankers later on when uh, Wind Ranger picks up a blink. Tusk can come out of nowhere. So Manta is really good for pushing out lanes. Your top tower is under attack. I'm gonna do another ancient stack here and kill it as well. Right now I have ultimate so I could fight. I don't really want to because I'm the position one hard carry I just want to farm. 
I don't really want to fight, but I can if a good opportunity comes. So... Farming around a spot where there can be potential fight is good. If I farm here, we still have tier 1 mid and bot. So tier 1 and tier 1 middle, tier 1 bottom are two of the enemy's objectives. So if I farm around here, there could a fight could easily happen here. What I'm trying to say, a fight can happen here easily. And if a fight happens around here, I could join. But I'm gonna need full HP though. It sucks to be. Go back. It sucks to miss two thirds of my HP. Well, let me take. Runes. I can't really defend the top lane. I don't think. Your top tower is under attack. Dire structures. Insignificant. Luna has Yules. Lina, I mean. Lina can kill Windrunner, so if Lina is top, it's okay, I feel. I don't have deep for both. The enemy's middle tower has fought. Yasha! BKB seems really good this game too. So I'll get Manta. I'll get BKB after Manta probably. The Manta is an item that will also speed up my farming. I could push out bottom lane, shove the wave. I don't have to farm the ancients there. That's a really good catch. Really good kill by the clockwork. Killing spree. Honey, a dominating performance. Double kill. There is my ultimate usage. Your top tower is under attack. We go bottom, we fight. We win fight and we take tower. Bring me, bring me. No, no, no. Okay, okay. You don't take my creeps away from me? Bro. The enemy's bottom tower has fallen. I have clarity for you. Thanks. Actually, I'm scared to push bottom right now. We just killed three of them bottom and we don't have vision deep in their jungle. Right now we're scouting it, so I can go bottom and push. Right now, yes. But un until now we had no information in there. So the three heroes that died earlier on bottom lane could have easily gone in their jungle or back to the bottom lane now. And if I pushed, I might have died. Troll and Battle Fury. Is that it? 
That's right, my farm. I could look to fight again. I don't have to push with my hero anymore. I can get more efficient farming by sending illusions. Is coming it's coming this way take the bottom runes i could tip it up and fight maybe after taking both runes it's not really good though Does not TP. Now he does. Dominating, I guess. What's happening there? A harvest moon. I guess whoever tried to TP bottom, Radiant his TP got cancelled. Just because I'm stronger than this guy right now, I don't have to send illusions and back. I can push with my hero and, and threaten him if he comes. The enemy's top tower has been denied. The problem is that if they come with more than one hero, that sucks. That's cut off. Your middle tower is under attack. This troll is so killable, but no one is. Your middle tower is him. under attack. We can go. Yeah, 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 I know. They have a center here, guys. I don't know if it was good to TP out of the bot lane. Fight here. Yeah, but we ah, you wasted global. Never mind. Play here, guys. Kill the troll. He is. He has just battle fury for fifteen minutes. It's actually insane that. My team is wasting their time completely on the mid and top lane and Troll hasn't died a single time. Ward this, ward their jungle and kill Troll. Just push me uh, bottom. Your middle tower is under attack. Careful, top. The 
enemy's bottom tent out for a wild battle. Your middle tower is under attack. Your middle tower has been denied. All is tough. Can we get the rune? Can we get the top rune? Yeah. I'm ready for a fight, I have BKB, Troll does not, he should not be ready for a fight. Don't chase dude, you might die. Stay close. Take Luna. I could still go butter mm. I'm not thinking about butterfly this game because they have MKB buyers. Objective gaming. Losing the ages like that was so bad, but For the cause. I think I am gonna go bu butterfly still. It's just that um Like, they will buy MKBs, but they can't afford them in the next 10 minutes. They should not be able to get MKBs in the next 10. So, Butterfly is an item that will be extremely strong. In the next 10 minutes. 
might even win the game. For it, please. And that's that's the butterfly right there. Really, really aggressive move from me. Yes. Really aggressive move from me, but I have butterfly, so it worked. Take the rounds. Take top. We can say calculated, okay? I knew the entire time when I went on 1v4 that I was gonna survive, right? I knew I was gonna be fine. I still want to scud this game though. He's probably gonna go battle butterf uh, MKB next item on troll. Okay, guys, we need wards on the map and they're all missing. Please play around me, I'm extremely strong. Yeah. If I didn't have butterfly, he probably would have killed me there. Like I'm actually this strong. Invisibility. We need everyone. Come with me. Just some damage. If we wanna fight bottom again, we're gonna take both drugs. I'm not ready. Careful both guys, we're not both. I don't have all Guys, go back. Go back. Another 
We are very split. Next ocean and we probably win game. I wanna defend bottom. Yes, BKP. We're not fighting enough. People are not fighting. I would like to fight a lot more than this. And lanes are constantly pushed and they are constantly split dealing with pushed lanes. But we're never in position to take a good fight. Everyone come rush. A clock, try to use uh, your flare for vision. We need to take barracks now. Oh yes, where are you? And, uh, without Ember they can't do anything, I think. And we have Vages. Just hit. Bottom, bottom. Yeah, let's wait my ult. Get back. I need to shrine. 
And we go again. We go mid. Somebody cut the mid lane creeps, so... It slowed our push a bit. Siege mid. If we kill them again, game is over. They don't have buybacks. all the time radiant structures are fortified mega i guess it's safer to go megas right Not bad, not bad. Nice building damage. What a hero. When it comes to buildings, Luna is one of the best. Twenty four seconds? I only died once in the early game, right? Yeah. 24 second respawn uh, death time. Super low. The troll had more creeps than me. This dude actually killed more creeps than me. And I thought I was killing a lot of creeps. He was doing a not bad job at keeping up, but uh, they still couldn't take it. The butterfly definitely saved my life when I yolloed into into three people mid or four people. At the end I wasn't even thinking about going satanic. I had AC on quick buy. But uh, AC would be nice only against troll. Also okay against windrunner I guess. I had a talent for lifesteal, satanic would just be a lot of lifesteal on top of that. But since troll is their carry and he deals all physical damage then I kinda thought of AC. But AC, satanic, definitely next item. 
well luna's um luna's item build isn't different anyway it's it's always this it's always like these items sometimes pike is good hurricane pike in some games can be good but it's overall like six or seven items that the hero builds every game what matters a lot is the order which one you need first this game i didn't feel like i needed pike so like manta was good first sometimes pike is good before manta but manta was good first so it can give me a bit of survivability it dispels chains frostbite access from troll i killed him once because i was able to dispel the the access mischance it was the fight around roche pit so yeah 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 not bad luna game i like it